So this is an incredibly high vibration tree. This is the what, Eastern White Cedar. So this tree for me has been a lifelong spirit ally. Um, so just a little little story for you. I used to call on this tree whenever I was feeling extremely down and I would immediately feel a rush of energy around me just clearing anything that was causing those lower emotions and I would just feel so empowered um, and it's for me just a very very special tree so it's the, the eastern white cedar there are cedars throughout the entire planet um, so it's really a beacon of life for me it's like a one of those plants that really connects you with deep earth consciousness and a lot of the wisdom that is stored within the crystalline grid I feel can be easily accessed through this tree it's really a, um, a portal so I, that's something else I wanted to share with you just be mindful that trees themselves they're incredibly high vibrational beings just like crystals so um, when you're in their presence like I said um, previously, you can provide something energetically in exchange. Just passing some white light through their branches, through their roots, um, and just saying thank you, just something like that. So that's just something I wanted to share. Okay, so this is a tree in the acacia family, and... It also has a very uplifting energy to it, just standing at the base of the trunk. I would say it's a lot more energetic in the sense that you'll feel a much stronger forward momentum so seems like it has its own rhythm to it i feel like each tree has their own rhythm it's like a music that you can listen to and for me this tree i think all trees really give you this sense of possibility so I, the way I look at it, these trees are conscious living beings, just like us. I believe that they're multidimensional beings as well. And I really encourage you to just begin to look at trees a little bit differently and see how you can incorporate the use of crystals with trees, with energy grids, and just seeing how your vibration increases and how the subtle energies affect you. So I just thought I'd share that. All right, so something else that I wanted to share about connecting with trees is that you can provide something to the tree energetically with your consciousness visualizing energy and a pillar of light extending from the sun from source down through the the center of the tree and as that light passes through the center of the tree it enters the center of the planet and it expands outward so that's just a simple visualization practice that you can use as you connect with the tree and you'll find that the more you connect with 
not just trees, obviously crystals too, but these are multi-dimensional beings. Um, and it not only assists you and your energy levels, but you also find that the area that you are in also receives a benefit. So it's very interesting effect and I recommend everyone to give that a try. So I just wanted to make a video at the base of this incredibly large sycamore tree about the vibrational raising effects of being surrounded with trees in a natural environment. So you may find this when you're walking in an old growth forest with very, very large ancient trees that create almost like a magnetic field and that they're amplifying the subtle energies of the planet. So just a, a quick tip and you may already know this, you may have felt this. Um, if there is a tree, it could be a sycamore tree, a willow, a cedar, depending on where you live in the world. Those are just some trees that I usually spend some time by. Obviously this is a sycamore tree, it's incredibly large has an incredibly massive energy field and I feel I usually get visions downloads I feel incredibly revitalized after I spend time close to this tree be, be sure to be grounded so take your shoes off connect to this planet electrically connect um, yeah so I just wanted to share that with you if there's also an added benefit if you're nearby water and you have very large trees that are growing close to water that, that would also increase the kind of subtle energies that you may be feeling so I just thought I'd make that quick video and let me know what you guys think